This is a successful manufacturing company that, that I think we should be very, very proud of. I know, Rick, you are as a local MPP, and I want to say to the team here as well, uh, I'm proud of you. I mean, the fact that we're winning contracts here against some tough competition all around the world, whether it's in South Africa, whether it's in Asia, in the States, that's because the outstanding quality of work and leadership here at Unifab. I want to see more of it. Problem is, a lot of people right now don't have jobs. And while well, the team here are doing a great job, I bet everybody has a relative or a friend or a neighbor who's out of work. And all week long, they've been looking for a job. Come Monday, they'll be out looking for a job again, and there aren't enough jobs out there for people. Rick Nichols and I, we've got a plan to actually get people back to work, to make Ontario the top of the list when it comes to new business investment and more jobs. We'll do that by lowering costs for business so they'll invest. We'll do that by having a government that believes that we need to be number one when it comes to jobs. So we'll get out of your way, get behind you, help you create jobs again. And one that believes that government has to spend within its means and not run up the debt like we've seen from the Liberals and their coalition partners in the NDP. By the time ahead, people face a choice. I mean, if you're happy the way things are in southwestern Ontario, well, I guess the good news is you've got two choices, the Liberals or the NDP. But if you believe we can do better, we believe we can get more jobs and help businesses grow, then look to the PC and our plan to make Ontario number one for jobs again. Now looking at, at what you're offering these people, the innovation, the creativity, the growth that you've experienced, Jake and, and Abe, you know, over the last uh, several years, uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a tribute to the community. Plus the fact that uh, not only with business, but also, you know, you also have another business, and that's those Leamington Flyers. <laughs> and, uh, and of course, you know, uh, they attribute. You know, you provide employment for some of the uh, for some of the players, and of course, you take a look at what uh, what a hockey team in a small community means to the community itself. So again, I want to congratulate you both. You know, on what you've uh, uh, have done and are doing and continue to do you know for this community